All right, guys, beginning of my day. Let's see what I could make. I just came to kind of a good location. This is not the location I normally work out of, but I got here by taking a, a lift job. So this one don't make no sense. I'm not gonna get it. Yeah, this is a waste of time. So basically that's like 34 minutes for seven bucks. Plus there's gonna be waiting five minutes. Before you know, that's like a 40 minute job for seven bucks. It means you're not even gonna make $14 an hour. You're gonna make less. So my goal is at least for 20 minutes, 10 bucks or close to it because I wanna make somewhere around $30 28 to 35 dollars you know something like that at least uh, no less than 25 an hour so here's kind of like what's going on um as far as my diamond status it looks like i'm very close to losing it look at that acceptance rates at 84 percent to 85 so we'll see what happens with that if i lose it i don't care because i'm not going to be a slave to an idea that oh I'm a diamond and I know potentially there's a risk of getting kicked off the platform but hey we're considered contractors and if we cannot make our own decisions then it's like we're not contractors that would be very silly this is why there's all kinds of uh, you know the government basically looking into it to basically uh, change it from us being contractors to something in the middle between uh, an employee and a contractor because contractors get to make their own decisions they get to set their own hours they get to set their own rates they get to choose if they want to work or not they get to decide if it makes financial sense because after all this is your business and depending on the car that you drive, you're either gonna make money or you're gonna lose money, especially if you got a car payment or a car that is very expensive in maintenance, like my car is. It's paid for, but the maintenance, well, the maintenance, like oil changes and stuff, I mean, that's cheap. I could do that myself. But when a BMW breaks, it's very costly for you to fix. Now that maintenance could be very expensive. So right now I'm not getting any offers, so I decided to just sort of uh, just drive on the map. Uh, let's see. So this one's okay. So 10 minutes, four bucks. So 10 minutes, five bucks would would be ideal. So this this will be fine, because ultimately what you want to look at, you want to make sure that whatever you do take, that you know whatever job that you take per minute. Um, it should be all just ahead make to you, a like, left turn on rear like, road using the upcoming you, uh, left two lanes add them all up then you using the left two the lanes make a left turn make. on rear uh, road i don't know if i'm somehow making it sound uh incorrectly but let's just say you're looking only at the miles let's say 15 miles you're making 15 dollars an hour right i mean 15 miles you're making a dollar a mile let's just say that so you, you look at it like, oh, okay, I get to drive 15 miles at a dollar per mile, I'm gonna make 15 bucks. But it's gonna take you 60 minutes to do it, or 55 minutes. Well, that means you have wasted your hour and you're not gonna make any more than $15, that's it. If you are lucky and you get a tip, okay, well, that is that should be icing on the cake, that should not be uh, something you rely on as far as income goes. And of course, Right now, uh, for me, this is Friday, and this is 9.54 in the morning. Normally I just do like night shifts, but I completely shift uh, in the morning. So that, because the day starts at 4 a.m. So Friday morning, 4 a.m., that's when the day started. And I'm just getting started. This is my uh, first video of the day. Um, so I have three days 
to get a bonus, uh, the bonus is gonna be roughly $250, $260 if I complete 60 rides. I think like 190 for the first uh, five. Let me, let me see here. The bonus constantly changes, so hard to keep up. So 195 extra by completing 50 trips. So an additional 10 will get you another 60. So that's like 255 bucks that I could make. So I was close. Um, so that is the goal to do at least uh, 20 rides on Friday, 20 rides on Saturday, 20 rides on Sunday. So just ahead, make a right turn on Piper Station Drive. Three hundred dollars, at least, at least. Um, make a right turn on Piper Station work, Drive. That means twenty-five dollars an hour. Um, so every four hours, I want to make a hundred bucks. That's not including my bonuses, anything like that. Like if it's an area bonus, like uh, like a surge, fine. That is fine. Uh, tips fine so i want to make sure all that equals to be 25 dollars an hour and then i get additional uh bonus at the end of the week which would be that 255 dollars which ultimately that's going to be roughly you know 80 85 bucks a day extra to 300 dollars. so it means you'll make 385 380 dollars so that is like the, the goal you know but we'll see where it goes so anyways thank you guys uh for watching this video um take care see you on the next one hopefully you subscribe Make to my right, right turn. channel and i'm gonna be talking to you guys too uh face to face and uh, letting you guys know some of the strategies that i'm using to make money and share with you guys how much money i'm making um and